Hello, everybody. Welcome to Art So Wonderful Show. And I'm here to talk about one of our um, electrical boxes. Art So Wonderful created um, Art So Wonderful boxes in 2010. And so uh, all the wonderful boxes you see around everywhere is through our programs and through our partners in South Burlington. And we have done them in um, St. Albans and Rutland and a lot of places and so we are very fortunate to be able to give artists an opportunity to showcase their talent in public spaces. So this box right here is brand new and now our artists, we'll talk with you in a minute, is brand new. It's on uh, South Winooski Avenue and Bank Street in, in Burlington. And it, isn't it incredible? And this is an incredible box. So nice. So nice that Casey Clark is going to talk about in a few minutes. But before we go there, I want to talk about another project we have on Thorsten Way, our so wonderful lane. It's, um, it's murals that we're going to do all around the corner. We've got murals coming up there. Uh, we have murals from um, Juneteenth event, and Sarah Holbrook just put her incredible mural down there. And so we're going to fill up that whole alley all the way around. It's going to be a tourist attraction, and we're so happy. And I want to talk to you also about Poetry Pioneer, which is our uh, other uh, partners, Candace Owens. And we got a contest coming up for the best poetry. So far, 160 people have signed up for our Poetry Pioneer contest, which ended on the 1st. And so we got a new one coming up starting now. And so look up on PoetryPioneer.com. And so now, I'm going to let our artist, Casey Clark, talk about the, her inspiration, our muralist and, and um, artist, what her inspiration was by doing this box. Come on, Casey. Hello, everybody. So I came to this site with my friend Bruce, and we, he showed me this box. And I looked around the area, and there's a lot of brick buildings in this area and I just wanted to um, I wanted to combine the colors of brown and the brick and then also I just wanted to in the middle of this city um, to bring nature into the city so to remind people about um, what's happening underground that people can feel more connected to nature when they look at this um, so, um, I worked on this with my mom and this is, she, she did the artwork for the Fox and, um, I did most of the other stuff. She kind of was more of the artistic one. And so I did more of the general painting, which I love. I love this little flower. Um, and a lot of inspiration came from um, children's books. I've seen children's books where they have this whole story underground. Um, I wanted something that uplifted people. Um, and that's, there was one person that did this mushroom and um, they drew this mushroom and so I, I kept it and I, it was someone from the, that was walking by that drew this mushroom and then I just kind of added the paint to it and um, I, I talked to my friend who works with soil and um, she loved the idea so I kind of got some inspiration from local people. Thank you. Do you want to come see the box? So we got a fox, worm, a little interaction. The bulbs underground. A little bunny family. Okay, so on this side I got the the bones of an animal and this plant up here. Um, so I just wanted to mention my my I had my two boys come here one day and my eight-year-old did the eyeball here and um, when I was working here I had a lot of different people walking by um, and um, one day there was 
was somebody in a wheelchair and he stayed next to me the whole time and um, I felt kind of protected. Um, and then I also had lots of people walk by and um, say great work and they were excited about the, the art going here to cheer up the city. And I'm Casey Clark, Vermonter, and I look forward to doing some more murals. I'm thinking about mandalas. So hopefully in the area in Burlington, look for it. And thanks, Art So Wonderful. Thanks, Bruce Wilson. Hello, everyone. This is um, Art So Wonderful, Bruce Wilson again. And I'm very happy and excited to be able to be around our sponsors of 802, True 802, down here on Church Street and Ake's Place. And um, they've been helping us and been helping the community uh, with murals and and so now I want to talk let you talk to uh, let one of our sponsors Shane talk to you from 802 in Aix place. Hi my name is Shane O'Connell um, I'm one of the owners of True 802 uh, my business partner Josh Markle owns Aix place as well uh, we're local Vermont kids uh, grew up here been here our whole lives um, we are just trying to give back to our community we see there's a lot of um, you know negativity focus towards Burlington and we want to give back towards some positivity. Um, we're working with Art So Wonderful which is a great program cleaning up the streets and painting art on the mural on the walls and stuff.
Hello, everyone. Thank you for tuning in for our Art So Wonderful show. And about our murals, that's what we've been doing all around. And we want to thank our incredible sponsors. One of our sponsors is here right now, 2802 and Ake's Place. Shane, come say, close out the show. And uh, we want to thank our uh, muralist, Rick, for doing for this mural right here. He just did it. Nice, spray painted. <laughs> nice. Can we, why don't you come close out the show, uh, Shane? So Shane, one of the owners and manager of Ake's Place, 802 is going to close us out. Hey, greetings, this is Shane again. Um, again, this is just a real good opportunity for people to spread their art and uh, in a productive way and not be destructive. Um, you know, Bruce is willing to let anybody put their art on the wall. Um, so, you know, come down to 2802 if you want to uh, talk to us about that and we'll put you in touch with Bruce. Thanks again.